Hi, I'm Mark. And I'm Noah. And we're Viewmasters. Yep, Viewmasters. And just like the first thing we like to talk about, of course, is the judge. Yep, Mr. Aaron Judge. And he broke the home one record last night for the American League. And it's the new American League record. And he passed another former Yankees player Rod, Rod, named Roger Millis who broke or who who did the record 61 years ago. Yep, that was very, very incredible, man. Now we are sitting out by by the river and we'll try to get a little bit of it in. Alrighty. Okay, now, this weekend's football, it was really good, Yep. really like let down to the last minute. Yep, and they had 15 games with, with only one score. On Monday night, the 49ers won against the Rams 24-6. And now all the teams in the NFC West and the NFL are tied. Are, are tied now. They're both. They're all. They're all two and two. That that is incredible. And the team that's doing the best is Philly, Philadelphia Eagles, with their four and O record. And that's really incredible. And they haven't been undefeated this much since two thousand four. Yeah, that's great. So that was what, like eighteen years ago, huh? Yep. Wow. Same season that the page or that the Eagles went to the Super Bowl, but they lost it to the Patriots and Tom Brady. Yep. And Bill Belichick. And my team, the New Orleans Saints, played in London. Yep. Early Sunday morning, and they lost. Well, they they, they could have tied it. By kicking a field goal. They off to the Vikings. They off to the Vikings by not that many points. By three points. And, you know, they'll do better. They'll, they'll pick up. And the Giants won, too, over the weekend. Over the weekend. And the end, it was kind of wild. It was kind of insane, I should say. <laughs> because... The 49ers kept passing the ball around. <laughs> but, Hoping it would stay. <laughs> and the fireworks started going off before before the end of the game. In fact, they already knew that the Patriots or that the Giants were going to win. And then the game finally ended. Finally, <laughs> the Giants <laughs> won. Yeah. And now they're four and one. All no, right. three, and three and one. one. Yeah. But they they are really doing great this year. Now, Miami's quarterback, he he's going through a lot of stuff right now. Yeah, he's supposed to be out for this week against the, against the Jets. I hope to God he stays out longer. And that's a good game, uh, and that's supposed to be a good game because both of, of my relatives are fans of both are fans of both of the teams. Yeah, one loves the Jets and, and one, one loves, loves the Dolphins. Well, two actually of the Dolphins. My cousin Yoga and my grandpa Pervado and my aunt Yoga and loves the Jets. Yeah, the Jets did good. They they really shocked. They shocked everybody. Yeah, that was it was another good week in football. Yep. Now, let's talk about the NASCAR. Who won that? Chase. Chase Elliott. Chase Elliott got his fifth win of the season and his first playoff win of the season. And he became the first driver to advance himself into the next round. Yup. That was... Because the rest of the teams... Or because the rest of the drivers have, are not in the playoff drivers or not in the playoff and... And they, 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 and 
All, all of them won, but they were not in the payoff. But that undefeated streak ended this this past weekend when Chase Elliott won at Tyadega, and that was a wild race. Yeah, that was great till the end. That was such a great race. Yep. If that if that like if they had an extra two hundred yards, they would have. I think the other guy would have won. Who was that in second place? Bieni. Oh, yeah. Paul Bieni. He <laughs> almost he almost won, and he doesn't have a win yet. But guess what? If they even the playoff, but he could have gotten his first career win, and he could have been a stewed around a bit. Yeah, he was upset. I thought, yeah, he was really upset. But but he held it, you know. But anyway. <laughs> um. All right, so we're gonna be back witness more football and more and NASCAR. NASCAR at the Charlotte Bowl on and, Sunday at, on NBC and who knows in case you guys want to feed a wave it's on NBC at Sunday early in the afternoon now baseball going back 